Hi everyone, it's your favourite diabetic biker here. I uh, thought I'd pop out to a couple more. Since I haven't done one for a wee while, I did film a few a couple weeks ago during a couple of games in the city centre. I had some awesome film with the filtering on it, but unfortunately the camera didn't record one day. And the second time it did record, but uh, Setting on a life and went through yet, stuff on every card will get around you eventually. So I'm out tonight for my final ride of my little Repsol, this little baby here. She has done well. We've had 4,235 happy miles. We've been up and down the coast, we've done New York Hill, Easter Egg Run, we've done Beat the Olive Pool. Up north, so it will be a shame, but uh, I am getting rid of now. But also, getting rid of a harsh issues. Trading it in for a new model because I am now pleased to say that this morning I passed my category A mod 2 motorcycle license, which means, in layman's terms, I now have a full unrestricted motorcycle license in the UK. So I can ride any bike I wish. And it's a. Uh, I can't wait. As soon as I passed my test today, I was away buying a bike. Which I shall pick up tomorrow. Now I'm not telling you what bike it is. secret ha 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 but what I'm going to do is I'm going to post pictures on my Facebook page I think it's facebook.com slash the diabetic biker and I will also post pictures on my Instagram account which I think is it's just diabetic biker or the diabetic biker I can't remember but I shall post some links for you uh, so we can play Guess the Bike if you wish. And the first person to guess my bike will get a shout out on my next vlog. So, eh, uh, well, I'm trying to leave getting it out of so I'm just going to work on Maybe next week I'll do a vlog on it. So if you can caress, the caress, yes, if you can caress, if you can guess the bike by, say, Sunday night, so that's what's the 19th? 25th or 26th of August, I think. If you can guess the bike, I will give you a shout out in my next vlog. You know, especially if you are oh, another motor vlogger or something, that may get you some, some subscribers or something. Uh, so. Tomorrow, right, I'll have a new bike. And I can't wait. See, even just think of overtaking, it's going to be a lot easier than having to do this. Just sit behind slow people. Down my head in. So, it'll be good. God knows what's going on there. It's all the junk. I can't get used to riding this bike again after spending all day in the, the Suzuki Gladius. So, ah, uh, it'll be it'll be good fun, good fun, Didi. I'm trying to think what else has been happening. Thundercat's nearly done. Uh, I have the fairings on. I said I was bolting the fairings on the other night. All fine and dandy. Then, when I started the bike up just to let it run, the headlights weren't working. I thought, great, what do so? I thought, it's just a bulb. I'll get a new bulb for it. Uh, put a new bulb in. Didn't work. 
So I ended up just went out with my multimeter trying to find the problem. Checked the fuses, checked wires, checked the connections. I changed the the button on the left switch gear for the the dimmer, just because the button was actually cracked. So I had to change the the button. So I bought a new switch gear, which I thought I could just put right on, but no, because this bike I've got seems to be some kind of American Canadian import, which was not too much good. So I ended up actually having to uh, take the button off, uh, put a new button in, but one of the wee clips were broke, so what I ended up doing was cutting the kind of like the connection terminal button I did off the old one. Well, the one I bought to replace. Cut it off the one that was already on the bike. Soldered the, the other one on. And uh, that. And I thought, great, it's working. No. So, what I think is, I think there's a wire uh, broke somewhere. And I think sometimes whatever way you move it, the light comes on it went off so I've got it working this now but the dash lights aren't working now that's the next problem I'm thinking to just sell it the way it is with no dash lights or should I attempt to fix it depending on what the weather's like this week it's you know it's, it's Scotland well it's quite cloudy today it was a wee bit sunny earlier on but I'll tell you one thing it's only the 19th of August and it would bloody freeze you by the way. I'm out, I've got my Under Armour cold gear on, so I've got the trousers on, I've got the top on with my t-shirt. I have the thermal lining of my jacket on, just to try and keep warm. My hands are like ice with these gloves on. You'd actually think we're a winter, that shows you how bad it is. Good luck. 